Hey there, I'll show you how you can configure your controller to play Final Fantasy VIII. This is not the remaster version, this is the old game that Square Enix uh, gave us on Steam a long time ago. So let's first go into settings. And as you can see, I can't even uh, enter the controller menu. Uh, the game doesn't seem to recognize what I have plugged in. But uh, I'm using the PS5 controller on my side. And uh, should you use the uh, Xbox One or uh, something else, uh, this method should probably work uh, just as fine. So the first thing you'll want to check is your keyboard settings. So make sure um, either you use the exact same keys, so you'll be able to copy uh, the exact same thing as what I'll do uh, further along the road. Or uh, if you change anything in there, uh, ju just make sure uh, uh, you know uh, which keys are for which function. Uh, because uh, what we will actually do is kind of uh, emulate the keyboard on your controller. So every key is in there, we will have to bind it on the button. Uh, so yeah. Uh, we can do that in Steam, so let's exit the game and let's go in Steam, select your Final Fantasy VIII game and you can either click this button or uh, just right there, this will bring you the same interface and um, unfortunately I already did a video uh, on this topic uh, about two years ago uh, but the, the interface changed a little bit, uh, well, a little bit more than a little bit, but, uh, <laughs> uh, well, anyway, uh, just to make sure you're not confused with uh, an old interface and, uh, yeah. So, uh, this is my current configuration, if we view that, uh, this is what I have right now, which work, uh, which work fine, but uh, obviously on your side this is probably not you have uh, yet, but uh, let's do that again from scratch, so let's press here, and by the way uh, there, there are already a layout uh, created by the community that you can try if you wish, but uh, I'm unsure uh, which one uh, are good or not, so um, let's start from scratch. So select template here and uh, let's start from keyboard and mouse. So obviously uh, everything that, that is bound is uh, wrong, but we will change all that. So let's first apply this layout and then let's edit, edit this and we will uh, change everything. So these are the buttons and we will assign uh, keyboard keys uh, to these buttons. And uh, I know the original game, uh, in fact, this button would be the cancel key and this would be the uh, action button. But uh, I'm kind of used to uh, the new way uh, that Square Enix uh, uh, use uh, these buttons. So this will in fact be the action button and this will be action. But uh, anyway, um, just, ju just uh, inverse those two uh, if, you have, uh, if you wish to, to have it uh, like the original. Alright, so um, we will bind the X key for this one. So the cancel is C. Now um, to... Uh, to play card it will be the S key, to open menu V key and um, I'll use this button to rotate camera so uh, for this one uh, obviously it's not from the, from the mouse so let's select keyboard and this will be the uh, L1 is going to be H and R1 it's going to be G. Now back grip, I don't even know what, what this is, so let's remove that so nothing's funny uh, happens. 
if we touch uh, anything on our, on our controller that we don't intend to. And um, this will be the select button. So select is going to be the J key. And the start button is going to be the A key. All right, so this is good. Now the D-pad is your uh, directional uh, button. Uh, right now they're assigned to the uh, numpad uh, 1, 2, 3, uh, 4. Uh, this is not what I want, so... And not, and not even the numpad uh, number. The <laughs> it's not really good, but uh, well. Let's put the up key, down key, left key, and right key. All right, so now the trigger, so R2 and L2. Um, I don't want uh, the button uh, for the full pull, only a uh, soft pull will be good, so this is going to be, this is for R2, so uh, keyboard, it's going to be the F key, and for L2, it's going to be D. All right. Now the joystick. Uh, first, the right joystick. Normally, um, I wouldn't use that, but let's put uh, our camera rotation uh, on, the, uh, on this joystick. Should you uh, like uh, uh, to move your camera using the, the right joystick, uh, it would be uh, good. So let's put directional pad so we can use it like uh, buttons. And so for this, oh uh, yeah, right. Let, let's back up. So we can't move the camera up and down. So I won't assign anything for, uh, for those two. But uh, left and right, we can put for this one, I'll put the H key, and for the other one, I'll put the, um, the J, G key. All right, and the left joystick. So if you wish to, uh, to move your character using the pad or uh, the left joystick, uh, both will work uh, just fine. So it's already set on directional pad, so this is good, but we will put the up, down, left, and right. And um, you can actually uh, put a function if you press the joystick, but uh, I don't want anything for that. So let's remove that. All right, so this is good. Now the trackpad is kind of the, um, the mouse thing on your uh, controller. Let's remove that so nothing funny happens. So let's put none. All right, and I don't even know what gyro is. So none should be fine. All right, so let's preview this. So this is what we have right now. Looks good. So let's back up. And all right. Let's test that uh, in the game. And I'm sorry is, uh, if the volume is uh, a little bit loud because um, uh, I can't control the volume uh, in the way I'm recording this video. So, um, yeah, uh, I'll just test uh, my controller and let's see if this works. You'll have to trust me uh, if it works or not because uh, I won't be able to uh, record uh, my face and, uh, and my controller. 
All right, so action button, cancel. All right, these two, these two buttons works just fine. Now let's test the camera rotation. So L1, R1 works. And now I'm testing with the, um, with the right joystick and it works. Movement with left joystick, it works. Now with the arrow pad, it works as well. I can enter menu. And uh, I will assume the uh, card button works too. But uh, yeah, uh, everything seems to be good. So uh, have a good luck with that. And uh, hope, I hope this it, it helps you. So have a great day. Thanks. Bye.